Hey guys, what's up? Unrested here, and today we are at Nagai Park, and we're about to go take a look at the Osaka Museum of Nature and Science. Come along with me, and let's explore what it's all about. What's up everybody, I'm Rested here, and today I am in the Osaka Museum of Natural Science and History. And what this museum entitles is uh, taking a little bit of a look at the environment of the animals and the nature that survive in an urban setting altered by man. It literally says that uh, in the introduction when you come in here, written on the wall. Um, so we're just taking a look around, seeing uh, what kind of stuff they've got here. And I just want to start off with this hilarious exhibit right over here behind me. Can you see this? Yeah. <laughs> Gokiburi no Himitsu. Okay? That's what the sign says right there. Gokiburi is cockroach. And as you can see, cockroaches are one of the main survivors in an urban environment. And definitely something that you will encounter in your trips to Osaka, should you come here. Taking a look over here, another exciting animal is the pigeon. Now, this is pretty weird. Uh, you're looking at this and you probably think this is an actual outside shop, but I'll back away to show you that this is actually an exhibit. So they're pretty awesome exhibits. They're pretty well done. Let's continue on. We'll take a look at what else we got here today. that's uh, indigenous to Japan, and that is the Taka Ashigani. It is, I think, also called the spider crab uh, in English, but this thing's leg span is absolutely insane. I mean, take a look. This is not a prehistoric animal. You can go to the aquarium here and actually see a lot of these. It's pretty amazing. Okay, we're at the second section of the museum, which is a new section that just got added on, and it is a dinosaur exhibit. Let's see what... Uh, Japan and Osaka has to offer as far as a dinosaur exhibit.
Okay, take a look at those. This is a gigantic dung beetle. And if you take a look right here, this is a lot of poop. Okay guys, that's the video for today. This is uh, Saka's Museum of Nature and Science. I hope you enjoyed that. If you're around the Nagai area in Osaka, check it out. It's 200 yen, which is less than $2 in American dollars. So I highly recommend it, if for nothing else, to support, you know, the nature and science research in Japan. Until next time, I'm Unrested. This is Jay Fack. I'll see you next time.